In this lesson, we learn how to find the length of either of the two shorter sides of a right-angled triangle using Pythagoras' theorem. Pythagoras' theorem tells us that a squared plus b squared equals c squared. c is the hypotenuse, which is the longest side. It is always opposite the right angle. a and b are the two shorter sides and are always adjacent to the right angle. To find the length of a, we need to rearrange the equation to get a on its own. So we start by writing down a squared. To remove b squared, we subtract it from both sides, giving us c squared minus b squared. We want a, not a squared, so we simply square root it. So we must also square root c squared minus b squared. We can use this formula to find either of the two shorter sides. We just simply label the missing shorter side as a. For example, here we know the hypotenuse and one of the shorter sides. We will label the other shorter side a. We will use the formula and substitute in the values that we know. C is always the hypotenuse, which is 13. B is the other shorter side, which is 12. 13 squared is 169, and 12 squared is 144. 169 minus 144 is 25. The square root of 25 is 5, so the missing side is 5 centimetres. 11 centimetres is the hypotenuse, and 6 centimetres is one of the shorter sides. We label the missing shorter side A. Next we use the formula and substitute in the known values. C is always the hypotenuse, which is 11. B is the known shorter side, which is 6. 11 squared is 121, and 6 squared is 36. 121 take away 36 is 85. Using a calculator, the square root of 85 is 9.2, rounded to one decimal place. So the missing side is 9.2 centimetres. Visit mathsathome.com for further videos and practice.